Marco Asensio's team leading third La Liga goal of the season sparked Real Madrid's 30 victory over Eibar. Despite scoring three goals and keeping a clean sheet, Zinedine Zidane admits Real Madrid weren't at their best against Eibar. Cristiano Ronaldo spurned a handful of opportunities, but Marco Asensio and Marcelo were on hand to lead Real Madrid past Eibar. Cristiano Ronaldo spurned a handful of opportunities, but Marco Asensio and Marcelo were on hand to lead Real Madrid past Eibar. Real Madrid coach Zinedine Zidane said that Cristiano Ronaldo deserved to retain the Best FIFA Men's Player Award on Monday evening in London, speaking after another personally frustrating domestic showing for the Portuguese in Sunday evening's 30 La Liga victory at home to a bar at the Bernabeu, Madrid East to victory over an out-of-form a bar, helped on the way by Paulo Oliveira's 18-minute own goal, which was soon followed by a clever Marco Asensio finish past unsighted goalkeeper Marco Dimitrovic. The second half was lower key until late on when substitute Marcelo rounded off the scoring with a sweet low strike to finish off a superb one-touch move also involving Karim Benzema and Theo Hernandez. 24 hours before he is likely to beat Barcelona's Lionel Messi and Paris Saint-Germain's Neymar to another individual award, Ronaldo was again not at his sharpest and missed a second half one-on-one -on -one with Dimitrovic. But Zidane suggested in his post-match news conference that the 32-year-old's decisive contribution to last season's La Liga and Champions League double was all important. Ronaldo is the best player of his generation, by a long way, Zidane said. He has shown that many times, he makes the difference in the big games. It is very deserved what he is winning tomorrow, all his prizes are deserved. He always shows he wants to be the best, and he is... Ronaldo is still on just one La Liga goal in 201,718, from 33 shots, however Zidane said such statistical anomalies were not a concern. When Cristiano does not score I get asked always the same thing, he said. We are not worried, although it is better when he scores. It is important for him, but the most important is that he is getting chances. This lasts a long time. He is top scorer in the Champions League, and has a chance to score again next week in La Liga at Girona. Cristiano Ronaldo has just one La Liga goal this season. Zidane himself is also shortlisted for the Best FIFA's Men's Coach Award, alongside Juventus Massimiliano Allegri and Chelsea manager Antonio Conte. Madrid goalkeeper Keylor Navas is also favoured for recognition in the goalkeeper category, where the other nominees are Juve's Gianluigi Buffon and Bayern Munich shot stopper Manuel Neuer. After becoming the first team to retain the European Cup in the Champions League era, Madrid are also expected to dominate the FIFA FIFA Pro World XI selection. They have 12 players in the running Ronaldo, Navas, Sergio Ramos, Rafael Varane, Dani Carvajal, Marcelo, Luka Modric, Toni Kroos, Isco, Case Miro, Gareth Bale and Karim Benzema. Sunday's result lifts Madrid back into third place in La Liga, although they remain five points behind leaders Barcelona. Zidane admitted his team had lacked fluidity but reminded critics that like their star forward they play their best when the really important games came around. We did lack a bit of fluidity in our play, he said. But the most important thing for us was to win, and score goals. We got three, and kept a clean sheet, which is important for us too. We also made many five changes. Today, so we can be happy with how they all played. We cannot play at our very best every week, it is impossible, but when there is a trophy to be won we do it as against Manchester United and Barcelona in August Super Cups. Dermot Corrigan is a Madrid-based football writer who covers La Liga and the Spain national team for ESPN FC. Follow him on Twitter at Dermot Corrigan page 2 Craig Burley and Alexis Noon sift through Cristiano Ronaldo's stats from 2017 as he claimed the Best FIFA Men's Player Award. Brazil coach Tite voted for Cristiano Ronaldo over his own player Neymar on his FIFA ballot for the Best Men's Player Award. Ronaldo took home the award for the second consecutive year on Monday, beating fellow finalists Lionel Messi of Barcelona and PSG's Neymar. The award, which covers the period of November 20, 2016, to July 2, 2017, is voted for by national team coaches, captains and selected media, who each listed a first, second and third place choice on their ballots. Voting results released by Craig Burley and Alexis Noon sift through Cristiano Ronaldo's stats from 2017 as he claimed the Best FIFA Men's Player Award. As FIFA announced the three candidates for awards including Best Player and Best Manger, see who's being tipped for success. 
Ballon d'Or candidate Isco fancies Real Madrid teammate Cristiano Ronaldo to retain the trophy next January. Cristiano Ronaldo claimed the Best FIFA Men's Player Award for a second straight year on Monday night, beating his regular rivals for the top prizes Lionel Messi and Neymar in the process. The Real Madrid forward is once again regarded as the world's greatest footballer by the World Games governing body and he is also the favourite claim of fifth Ballon d'Or award, which would draw him level with longtime Barcelona rival Messi. ESPN FC's club correspondents give their verdict on the final. Craig Burley and Alexis Noon sift through Cristiano Ronaldo's stats from 2017 as he claimed the Best FIFA Men's Player Award. Ballon d'Or candidate Isco fancies Real Madrid teammate Cristiano Ronaldo to retain the trophy next January. Real Madrid star Cristiano Ronaldo has beaten Lionel Messi and Neymar to win the Best FIFA Men's Player Award for the second year running. Ronaldo, who won the inaugural prize last year, was presented the award at the Best FIFA Football Award Ceremony in London on Monday. The Portugal captain had been favourite to claim the accolade after a year that saw him help Madrid to a third Champions League crown in four seasons and a first La Liga title in five years, as well as the FIFA Club World Cup. Ronaldo, Craig Burley and Alexis Noon sift through Cristiano Ronaldo's stats from 2017 as he claimed the Best FIFA Men's Player Award. Marco Asensio has handled much of Real Madrid's scoring through the first three months. Real Madrid were distinctly businesslike in dispatching a bar 30 on Sunday, thanks to an own goal and strikes from Marco Asensio their top scorer and Marcelo. The gap with Barcelona is still five points but all Zinedine Zidane's men can do is keep pace ahead of El Clasico in December. One thing that stands out is that only five players have started more than two-thirds of Madrid's league games this season. And, of those, only Casemiro and Sergio Ramos are regulars, the others, for those.